Hotkeys is the word Obsidian uses for keyboard shortcuts. Now, there are some ways to find out what are the keys to use to activate a certain function. For example, right here, we have them listed. Uh, I'm using a Mac, and in this case, create a new node is common N. But you can also go to the palette. So if I use common P on a Mac or control P on Windows, you can see the list of many functions. And here, right here, you can see the keyboard uh, shortcuts. To see all of them, we can go to the settings and click on hotkeys. Here you can see all the functions that already have a keyboard shortcut like this one, this one, and this one, and all the other ones where you can add your own keyboard shortcut. So if we want to create one, let's say for this one here, just click the plus and press the keys you want to use. So let's try shift common F. Okay, here's a problem. There is this red color because shift command F is already in use. Now there are two options. You can either choose another uh, combination for this one here, or you can go all the way to the top here, click here on the filter box, click the keyboard and type shift command F. And now you know what is the function using that keyboard combination, that hotkey. From here, you can remove this one and create a new one for this. Or again, like I said before, use a different one for that other function. There's one more thing that I want to share with you, but before that, we should take a look at this information on Obsidian's help page. If you are using a non-US keyboard, sometimes when you type something on your keyboard, let's go back to that uh, page there, because the keyboard you are using may have a different layout compared to the US keyboard. This here may show a combination that matches the US keyboard instead of the keyboard you're using. But no matter what you see there, whatever you set here is what will trigger the function. Okay, so now the last thing I want to show you is the plugins. Many of them it have also options to add hotkeys or already have hotkeys. So let's try this one here, recent files. So as you can see here, recent files open. This will open the list of recent files, but it is blank. So I can set one here and I'll try shift command R and that's available. So now if I close this, I just created my own hotkey. And if I type shift common R, there it is. The list is there. This video is part of my Obsidian quick tutorial series, and you can watch other videos similar to this one right here. And if it was helpful, I'd appreciate a thumbs up. If you want to help even more, please consider supporting my work on Patreon or YouTube. Thanks for watching. See you soon.